Yo, that woe is us. We're in a lot of trouble. Folks, we have hope. Change. Hope and change. Change and hope. Hope and change. Change and hope. Hope and, hope and change. Change hope. In other words, chop. That woe is us. We're in a lot of trouble. That woe is us. We're in a lot of trouble. Woe is us. We're in a lot of trouble. This is supposed to be your Congress. The overwhelming dominance of corporate power. It radiates and adversely affects how we use our tax dollars, how we spend our tax dollars, the tax system, uh, whether people are going to get full health insurance, whether they're going to get a living wage, whether the whether we're going to bail out these corporations who are corrupt on Wall Street. The corporatization of our life, the commercialization of our life, subverting civic values and corrupting the electoral, political, and governmental system is the overriding issue. And it was like uh, nobody talked about it. Corporate crime wave, corporate welfare, uh, corporate determination of our environmental future, our genetic future, our educational future. It was a massive exercise in the language of avoidance. A $700 billion blank check for the crooks, swindlers, and speculators on Wall Street who misused trillions of dollars that belonged to worker pensions, mutual funds, and other small investors. 1,500 or so corporations get their way with a majority of those 535 men and women in the Senate and the House. Keep in mind, 535 men and women who put their shoes on every day like you and I do. These corporations have a lot of power and money, but they don't have a single vote. We're the ones who have the vote. Now, let's not exaggerate what it takes for us to make this a People's Congress instead of a Congress in the pockets of big business. It's got to be you and the way you vote. Yourselves. Because that's the only place you're ever going to find any real truth. <laughs> but man, you're never going to get any truth from us. We'll tell you anything you want to hear. We lie like hell. We'll tell you any shit you want to hear. We deal in illusions, man. None of it is true. But you people sit there day after day, night after night, all ages, colors, creeds, we're all you know. You're beginning to believe the illusions we're spinning here. No, I momentarily forgot about choke. We should have a government of the people, by the people, for the people. Thank you. Here he comes now, the big hand. I'm Mr. White Christmas. I'm Mr. Snow. I'm Mr. Icicle. I'm Mr. Ten Below. Whatever I touch turns the snow in my clutch. <laughs> I'm too much. <laughs> He's Mr. White Christmas. He's Mr. Snow. He's Mr. Icicle. He's Mr. Tenderloin. Friends call me Snow Miser. Whatever I touch turns the snow in my clutch. <laughs> I never want to know a day that's over 40 degrees. I'd rather have a 30, 20, 10, 5, and then it's free. He's Mr. White Christmas. He's Mr. Snow. That's right. He's Mr. Icicle. He's Mr. Tenderloin. Friends call me Snow Miser. Too much. Ha <laughs> ha! Too much! Turn them off! This is a theater of the absurd, my friends. This is a theater of the absurd. <laughs>